Hi, welcome to the Guys Show. I'm Whitey, and I'm going to give just a quick video. On, I'm, I might even like change the channel name to I Can't Watch This. Um, I was just clicking on YouTube, and I came across a video, a clip rather, of um, Cobra Kai Season 5, and Daniel LaRusso's character is fighting the Terry Silver character, which, if you're not familiar with the whole... Karate Kid Mythos, that was that came in deep into the sequels and it got so absurd. Um if you could ever enjoy the Karate Kid, it, that was it, it, the, when you got into three, four, or five, or how many there even were, it was so ridiculous that it was un, in my opinion just unwatchable. So they're trying to relive that. It's just like why? But the, I saw a clip earlier where John Kreese goes up to the Terry Silver character, and Terry Silver has always been this big, rich guy, uh, and they were in Vietnam together, which is just... But they addressed the stupidity of the, of the premise that this big, rich guy would give a shit about some karate tournament, some obscure karate tournament in Torment Some Teenager. And if that's what, what the show was more of, I would be okay with it. But instead, it goes right, it falls right back into the same absurdity. And so I'm watching this clip of these two guys in the late 50s, early 60s, because I think Terry Silver is only a year or two older than um, the other guy, Daniel LaRusso. What's his real name? Oh my God, dementia. So they're in their 60s. Late 50s, early 60s, Terry Silver's got gray hair. Dane LaRusso it just is looking his age. And it's just like, seriously? You're, you're just a few years from the old folks' home. You're getting letters from AARP. And you give a rat's shit about some karate tournament 40 years ago. A, you gave a shit about the karate tournament at all. And B, four years ago, C, you're in your 60s. Like, this is so, and it just doesn't. So when they restarted the channel, they restarted the, the Netflix series. It was kind of interesting for an episode or two because it was jo focused on Johnny Lawrence and what happened after this moment. And where is he now? And it was kind of cool because you found him down in the dumps, really struggling. And then he got his life back up and running. You know, he he found his old pride and and strength in who he was and, and re, you know, rebuilt. And then struggled with that a bit and kind of had to balance and recalibrate. That's a great idea. That's a great idea for a Netflix series. And the, But the clips... So I, I saw the first... One or two episodes of season one, it's I, unwatchable. It, it it's not only it's it's like so episodic. Everybody, all the boys are dating all the girls, and all the modern politics has to be thrust in there, and feminism, and then the whole town gets caught up in some karate tournament from forty years ago. Oh my god. And they're like, we're bringing back Cobra Kai. Dude, I would never go to the guys I ran. I, I, I ran into a guy yesterday. Maybe that was even today. Oh, Dimension's winning so bad. Um, my old buddy Joe from that I was on the wrestling team with. I was leaving the gas station. I was like, hey, is that Joe? We talked for a few minutes and he had to go to work and that's what it was. I was I'd never go to that guy and be like, Joe. We lost the wrestling meet in 1998, and we got to bring it back. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're in our fucking 40s. I just turned 40 a few months back, and I'm sure Joe's coming up on 40. I'm not going to go look up the guys and be like, we got to go hunt down dudes who are now, you know, like young grandparents. Like, my sister's got two kids. She's a grandma. 
I'm worried about the wheelchair. I ain't worried about some wrestling me 20 years ago. Now, granted, I was a shit. I was middling at best. I had a winning record. I never even wrestled on varsity. So, yeah, this was the championship. But of a karate tournament 40 years ago. Like, dude. So, if somebody was like, hey, bro. We're getting together with the dudes from the football team. We need you to come back and play center, bro. We're taking on the Crosstown division rivals. Uh, we got to go play some flag football. I bet I went ahead and fucking yell. Let's go play some football. Brr. And then we play some touch football or some flag football or something for an hour and a half with some dudes. I don't could even tell you their fucking names from 20 years ago. And it'd be kind of fun. The whole, and, and it, they got, you know, wives and kids. So the kids be like, go get them, dad. I remember going, my dad was playing at the Y when I was like five. Playing some basketball because he used to play some high school basketball. And then they had like some reunion soccer teams. He was all conference or something. He was a soccer player from a really small town. And so, you know, you get back together with the guys. Okay, sure. But the whole town, all these platoons of people are going to get caught up. And your old rivalry, and then the, the kid ends up paralyzed because he felt the balcony, and the hot dude's beating the crap. The high school's in a riot because it's some karate tournament from 40 years ago. Holy shit. And then they're like, Daniel Russo is like, Johnny Lawrence. I gotta stop this guy's freaking back, Cobra Kai. Who gives a shit? And then the dude is like, put him in a body bag. He's dead. <coughs> the actor died in real life, so the character died in the show. Who gives a shit? The guys who picked on you in high school are but once, like in prison or something. I think the Dutch character is supposed to be in prison in the logic of the show. And yeah, the guy's dead. It's down to you and one more guy. It's like, seriously. Let it fucking go. It was a karate tournament 40 years ago. And if Home Slice wants to bring back Cobra Kai, who gives a shit? Don't you have a successful business, Mr. Car Salesman? And then he's like, everybody buys a new car. Well, get a tree, the little plant, whatever the fuck they're called. Like, they're going to know why that's even happening. You know, Mr. Miyagi taught him this shit back in 86. And so in 2021, Jack off McGurk is picking up his Ford and he's going to know why he even has this little fucking tree. It was 40 years ago. This isn't MJ versus LeBron. This isn't Jordan versus Bird. It's an obscure karate tournament. <laughs> From fucking fuck. There was like 200 people in the stands. Oh my god. My junior year was one of the one year, though, in kind of like one time in 10, 15 years since that we beat our rivals and at the football game. And I was a starting no nose tackle. And our head coach was like, there's like a trophy that changes hands, whoever wins that game. And they've had it for so many years. And I don't even know what they did. Like, I, 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 I couldn't even tell you what it looks like. I don't give a fuck. It's 20 years ago. I can't fathom 20 years from now, some guy from the other football team being like, Whitey, you threw that key block on that key play, you son of a bitch. And I'd be like, I was on the defense. And he's like, were you kidding? <laughs> I didn't throw a block. <coughs> you made the tackle that made the difference. Now I'm coming for you. I'm going to be like, I don't remember. Hardly a, uh, I couldn't tell you a guy, a rest, name of guy I wrestled against. I couldn't tell you any like key points in any football games I played in. And I'm 40. 
These guys are 60. And they're still holding a grudge. And they're going to duke it out. And then they see him talking about dudes like bleeding down his face. And it's like, this is so fucking ridiculous and stupid. And then there's all these like teenagers standing around like, what happened if grandpa was that they fight? And it's like, two old guys are going to end up in the hospital because they're fucking old and fighting. Who cares who wins? What's at stake? Oh my god. If I, to if I saw two senior citizens fighting it out 40 years ago, there was a karate championship. <coughs> I would just get in my car and leave. Or walk away. I'd just go home. And maybe that's why I only got 300 subs on this channel. Because I don't go run screaming to the drama and be like, I gotta know how this ends. There's two 60-year-old guys who can barely kick. <laughs> duking it out in the parking lot of Walmart. Oh. I can't watch this show, dude. So that's 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 the new thing on the Whitey White Guy show. I'm just that's the only thing left. I can either go back and rewatch Karate Kid and say the same shit and point at the same shit. Sweep the lake, Johnny that everybody else has covered a million times. Or I can talk about why I can't watch this, because it's so fucking bad. Why didn't I fin here's why I didn't watch Twilight. Here's why I didn't. Go and see Captain Marvel. Here's why I still haven't seen the Ghostbusters 2016 movies. Because I'm not a fucking communist. And I don't need the message shoved down my throat. And I don't give two sweet fucks about female empowerment. When it was when it was in the 80s. And Daniel LaRusso was from the East Coast. And he was like some Italian kid in this all white blonde kid school. And it was like, we don't accept you because you're an outsider. And that kind of made sense. But seriously, you're 60. Fuck, get over it. By the way, you got the blonde. Why, why are you complaining? You you got the blonde girl and the trophy. And your pee pants? Shouldn't Johnny... So when Johnny, when he started the series, Johnny Lawrence is upset. That makes sense. He lost the championship. He lost the girl. And, and and then, you know, that it derailed his entire life is utter fucking nonsense. But, you know, that, that he's upset, I get it. That makes sense. What's Daniel LaRusso upset, upset about? And what's going to happen? Johnny Lawrence isn't going to come to your house and beat you up. He's minding his fucking business. <sighs> Worse yet, then John Kreese shows up. And starts beating the shit out of people. It's like, aren't you 70? You should be celebrating the fact that you're still alive. You shouldn't be running around getting in fights. So, I can't watch it, bro. I can't watch it. I can't watch Cobra Kai. Next week, the Twilight series. And everything the fuck else that's happening now. God damn, I missed 1995. <sighs> Cheers.